Hi guys! So my voice is a little bit cracky because I have a flu but I really really wanted to film today so I'm making this video for you guys. Um, last week I was at this church concert thingy-jiggy and we had a Q&A session and they asked some questions and one question really stood out to me so I decided to talk about it on my channel. The question was why do pastors discourage young relationships? Now this is my personal opinion about this topic. I could be right, I could be wrong, but this is basically what I understand. Um, when you talk about young relationships, ugh, young relationships, in my head I'm thinking, okay, between the ages of 16 to 17 and under, why most preachers or most pastors or parents uh, and all that discourage young relationships is because at that age you're still trying to discover yourself like you're still you know finding out what you like what you dislike and all that so getting a, getting in a relationship especially with someone that has it all planned out basically that knows what they want if you're not careful you're going to lose yourself because you're just going to keep following that person and like doing whatever they like you'll be forced to like what they like and to dislike what they like what they dislike, sorry. If you're not careful, when you guys break up, you're going to have to start from scratch because you spent a significant amount of uh, of your life just following someone and not, you know, growing. So you're just going to like be heartbroken and then you have to, you know, build yourself. So why um, people advise not to get into relationships because at that age you're supposed to you know build yourself know your value so when you get into a relationship you have um, something to offer you have like you just you're going to be someone of worth basically like that no one's gonna push you about and everything like you're going to know what you want and who you are and what you represent and what you stand for and when you're single you also have time for God more like you know God for yourself and all that kind of stuff so yeah I think that's the first reason why most pastors discourage young relationships. I believe there are two kinds of relationships. You have the sexual relationship where you know you guys are just with each other for sexual pleasures, for the gifts, for going out, for flexing and all that and for I'm in a relationship tag. And then you have the other relationship where two mature individuals come together and they're like, hey I find you know good potentials in you, I want you to be my partner, like I wouldn't mind settling down with you. And this kind of relationship, like, the two people genuinely come together trying to help each other, trying to build each other. Like, if one person has a gift or has a skill, the other person is trying to help the other person and the other person is also trying to help the other person, if that makes sense. But basically, they're in the relationship trying to grow. Like, they don't really want the sexual pleasures and all that. They just want to make sure that person is good enough for them to get married to. And I'm a kind of person, I believe, you know, you shouldn't just date someone for one or two years and just get married to them. Like, it's best to date for a long time because there's no getting out of marriage. Like, as a Christian, you shouldn't think of divorce. So if you just hurry up and date someone and get married to them, you're going to see the true colours in marriage. And it's not that funny because dating is totally different from marriage. Like, it's a total different ball game. So... Um, so in conclusion I believe before you get in a relationship make sure you know what you want make sure you know what you stand for so that you will not be swayed by the wind um, just make sure you know you and again make sure you have God in your relationship because there can be relationships with God I don't believe that everyone should just discourage relationships that relationships are bad and everything no there are some relationships that are quite good so make sure you have God in your relationship and make sure you know what you stand for and make sure you know who you are so you don't get lost in a relationship. Please like, please subscribe and please share my video. Thank you.